y únicamente no es solamente la casa, sino que también estas familias no tienen alimentos, no tienen ropa, no tienen mesas, no tienen sillas. Eh, estamos en unos tiempos donde el mundo ha cambiado un montón, pero para <laughs> ellos nosotros somos el cambio. So they, they don't have uh, food, they don't have clothes, they don't have a table to eat. For them, we are the change, but they still live in the same conditions. So with you guys and with us, we are trying and we want to be the change that they need. Got introduced to the family. He said they're living off two, three dollars a day. I mean, when you see this, it's just, you know, the things they got to go through. You hear about it, but you don't see it until you're here. I'm just, I'm just shocked. We, you start digging. Us, it's you know it's ten days out of our lives. But as for the family that we're building it for, yeah, they're, they're so grateful. It's a place that'll improve their uh, you know their way of life. They're happy like right now. They they they're a good family. Trying to make this house a reality. Talking about the camaraderie, it's pretty unbelievable. The spirit and attitude you can you can't actually more. Kind of relying on on each other. So I think that's what's really bringing us together. I knew after the eight or nine days we'd be close. Now it seemed like <laughs> I have knew them for a couple weeks now. You can tell because we've been grinding every day, grinding. You know we've, we've started this house now. You know that everybody on this site is gonna finish it. Achieving what we ask has proven fatal to us in the past. Still, we must take up the challenge, although a daunting task. This world without walls, we must believe it's possible. If you feel it in your heart, nothing's impossible. Collectively, let's put our conscious minds to it. We can speak it into being as we do it, break it right through it. It would be better for us all if we did it. We don't push them, we will never ever see them fall, not at all. These imaginary walls that have been erected in between us, standing skyscraper tall. Listen, y'all, they don't belong in a land where it is free. Watch them crumble to the ground eventually. I'm just so blown away. It's the hardest work I've probably ever done in my entire life. I'm really happy I did it. You know, if I ever have moments of doubt or whatnot, and I just go, you know, I'll just look back at this trip. It's going to carry over to a lot of things in my life. It was, it was truly a Beers Without Borders experience. Mm. Great ending to a great journey. Yeah, I think I'm just really blessed to be able to come here and be able to rebuild this house from, from the ground up. And to help people. And see how they, how they live. It unites everyone. It feels like a family. It's exciting. It's awesome. It's real. These lights should come on.